If you guys want to learn how to get better FPS while streaming or recording in OBS Studio, then this is a video for you. Let's get right into it. What is going on everybody is once again Oda here bringing you guys a tutorial on how to increase your FPS in game while streaming or recording in OBS. Now of course the first step which most of you have probably already done is opening up OBS Studio. Now it doesn't matter what scene or source you're on. All you're gonna do from here is you're gonna go here to the settings bar now once you're in the settings box here the first thing you're gonna do is go to video and this is the first change you're gonna make right here where it says downscale filter be sure to select this to bilinear fastest but blurry of scaling be sure to select that only if you aren't scaling and in case if you don't know what scaling is it's making your resolution lower than your monitor resolution is so for example right here output scaled resolution if these are matching to 1920 by 1080 then you are not scaling but let's say this is at 1280 by 720 that means you are scaling and if that's the case then you should switch this to bicubic or lank sauce but most of you guys are not scaling because there's not really a point in doing that so if both of those are at 1920 by 1080 simply select bilinear that'll be the best that's going to be the most confusing part of this video most likely and I'm sorry if you didn't understand how I explained that because I probably did a terrible job. But if you still don't understand what scaling is, just search up on Google. I'm sure a much better explanation will come up. Now, once you've done that, you're going to go down here to the advanced tab and then process priority right here. Change this from, I believe it's usually on normal, change it to above normal. I found that helped a lot with my OBS lagging. So just be sure to change it to above normal. I wouldn't recommend high as your game will probably start lagging at that point. So just leave it at above normal. That is the best option you can have. And then once you've done that, you're going to go over here to your output tab. Make sure your output mode is selected to advanced. Make sure you're also selected onto the streaming tab. Once you're here, these changes are only going to be able to be made if you're using the NVIDIA encoder. Most of you are probably using, I don't imagine any of you using your CPU. Now this is a really random change, but I'm not sure why it helped a lot right here where it says preset change this to blu-ray again i'm not sure why but that is the best for performance and quality so just change that to blu-ray and then down here gpu i'm not sure what this is on default but make sure gpu is on zero and make sure b frames is on one then once you do that you're going to go over to the recording tab and copy basically what we did in the streaming tab so preset blu-ray gpu zero and b frames one now those are all the changes you need to make in your settings so go ahead and click apply and then okay and there's one more step into getting better fps while streaming or recording and what you're going to do is while you're streaming or recording whichever one you're going to go over here of course you have your preview here and you have these empty spaces go over to the empty space right click and click enable preview and then you'll know it's disabled when it says preview is currently disabled. I found that helped a lot with CPU usage and in-game performance. And of course, if you want to ever enable it, you can always just do the same thing. Right click, enable preview. It's really easy to switch, but I found that helped a lot. But anyways, guys, that is it for this video. If this did help you out, as always, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Share this video with whoever's having problems streaming or recording. And also, if there's something you're confused about or need help with, please be sure to comment. I will... Be sure to help you guys really quickly and if you're new here be sure to subscribe for more content i do upload frequently and i think you guys watching this right now would enjoy my other videos a lot but yeah guys that's pretty much it for this video hope this helped hope you enjoyed leave a like subscribe of course like i said do all that good stuff and i will see you all in my next video peace out everybody